Hello everyone, and welcome back to Old Friends Dog Game, the game all about running a sanctuary for senior poppers. And I just wanted to say a couple things before we dove in. First off, I should have known better. I should have known better, you guys. Of course the people of our pixel biology community would be extremely excited about a like game about any kind of animal rescue, but I was so happy and like weirdly proud and giddy about the idea that so many of you guys already knew about old friends dog game and so many of you had already been rescuing dogs in here and so many of you had even donated to trying to help out some of the sanctuaries around you after you like learned about the plight of senior dogs and it just made me feel the same kind of like whoa like awe and pride and gratitude and just all of those really like emotions that make your back kind of straighten up and make your worries fall off your shoulders and make you feel like yes okay sometimes the world can be a really rough place and sometimes things can be really hard but there are people out there who can help us make the world better and that is how i felt when i saw so many of you guys not only had seen old friends dog game but a lot of us had already decided like you know what i do want to help out senior doggos even if it's just a little bit and you reached out not only to like your sanctuary but I heard about people like in New Zealand and England and people like in other parts of the United States reaching out to their local sanctuaries and just seeing if they could kind of slide them by a little bit of dog food or even look for a senior dog or cat that you could go ahead and bring into your own lives. And I just wanted to say hi freaking five and I am so proud of you guys. And then the other thing I wanted to say before we dove back into straightening up everything is Mac! Look at his new little outfit, you guys! Um, I cough, cough, don't know where that came from, but Mac actually has a new little outfit now, and he's so freaking cute. Oh my goodness. Like, look at his little wardrobe. He's got a tiny little suit on and a cute little hat. I'm really in love with it. He also has, like, his little, like, award-winning ribbon, uh, but we're going to go ahead and leave him in this adorable little outfit. He also has a brand new... <gasps> Look at this! A brand new bed that he can lay down in! Isn't that so freaking cute? Ah, oh, look at this plant! Okay, I really want to get this plant out here too. Uh, I wonder how I can put those away. Oh, there! Okay. But I probably need to clean this place up, you know, get the walls looking a little bit nicer. Uh, ooh, oh my goodness. I'm like, Mac, you've made quite the mess everywhere, my friend. So let me go ahead and tidy this up while Mac goes ahead and sleeps. And then Mac is actually ready for us to go ahead and talk to him. Aha, another spot to clean up. Is actually ready for us to go ahead and talk to him so that we can unlock a next level to his story. But while he naps, yay! We're gonna go ahead and collect all of the amazing money that people have donated to the cause. Uh, I need to check in on my messages too. Feed any dog 10 times. Finish baking at least a, a basic treat 20 times. Uh, feed Mac two times. I live for dogs. Yay! All right, so we've already gone ahead and taken care of that. And then buy one thing from the Barket. The Barket is all, full of all sorts of wonderful things for dogs. I would advise grabbing some of their deals as soon as you can. Okay, the Barket actually has like a bunch of free deals, <gasps> like sticks. Okay, so we grabbed a couple free sticks. And then I think we have enough dog food and carrots to actually be able to cook quite a few things. So we should be there. Be good there. All right, there we go. We've completed that. Oh, and Opal wants us to clear three leaf piles from the yard. If it's okay, I noticed that Turbo Tail's home has a lot of leaf piles which need cleaning up. Better do that before they blow everywhere. Thanks. It would mean a lot. Like, I'm glad people are going to donate to us, but it's really awkward, like, having people just stare inside my house. Like, okay, so you're going to clean that, right? Uh, but all right, so let's go ahead and move a few things around. Can I move this lamp around? There we go. All right, the lamp definitely needs a little bit of patching up. Do I have a different flooring? We don't have a different flooring yet. Oh, but I can put up a different wall. However, I do want, there we go. I want a wall with a lot of windows. And it looks like this is the only wall with a lot of windows that doesn't look all beat up. So hopefully we'll be able to fix that later. But there we go. I liked getting all that done while Mac was sleeping. Let's come over and do a little bit of cooking too. We know a basic biscuit, so we can cook a few of those. How many can I cook? Oh, I guess I can only cook one at, like, two, three. Oh, wait, the oven queue is full. Oh, the oven takes a moment to bake these things. Oh, you should see my jaw. It's on the ground, you guys. 
So you want to just constantly be baking delicious dog biscuits in the kitchen. That's so freaking cute. I could totally get behind that. What does this do? For 30 bark bucks, you can queue an additional item for your oven. Ooh, well, we might consider that, actually. Uh, for now, I'm going to go ahead and add more to it. And now I have completed another one of the tasks. Oh, wait, it's these tasks we're supposed to be doing. Yep, yep. Uh, rescue a second dog. We do need to rescue a second dog in just a second here. Oh, my word. There's a lot popping down here. Oh, Master Chef. You think you've got, uh, think you're good in the kitchen? Prove it. Bake some biscuits now. Gosh, I'm really pleased that everybody is, like, eager to help my dogs, but they're a little, a little nosy, aren't they? Give wood stick to Mac two times. Let's see. Start baking eight treats from Peppermint Patty! Gosh, that brings, like, memories of Candy Cane Lane, um, which was a board game I used to play as a kid, just rushing back to me. I don't even know if they still make that board game, but, man, my sister and I used to love playing it. Good day, I'm an avid baker and would like to see your skills. You know what you should do right now? Some baking! Bake on! <laughs> oh my goodness, like a lot of people are just really, really like right up in your face. That's fine. Totally fine. Oh, I'm out of carrots! What the heck? Alright, let's go over to the shop. I gotta buy some- ooh, there we go. I'm just gonna like get a whole like bunny, bunny garden's worth of carrots. Wow, okay, good. So the food does not cost very much. Mac is not going to eat us out of house and home. That is a good thing to see. All right, we'll leave the treats be. Look at that, and now the treats are like cooking. How are we doing on the leveling up? I hope we're doing okay. Oh, Mac, Mac, oh, he needs pets. Who's a good boy? Who's a good boy? All right, now Mac got some pets, but he's sleeping on top of a big pile. So we'll just go ahead and play with him now. Buddy. You and Mac are enjoying a quiet moment together. He seems to be feeling a little down. How are you feeling, Mac? Oh, he does look sad. Oh no, not that soft, like, oh, sigh that dogs do when they are kind of just a little out of sorts. Oh no. You can't help but wonder what's wrong. Maybe he's getting used to the new place. Do you want to cuddle, Mac? Mac is disinterested. Do you want another dog to play with, Mac? Mac lifts his head. He must be feeling lonely. Maybe I should ask around about that mystery dog. Oh, even with his cute little outfit, Mac is just like, I wish I had another dog to play with. I really feel strongly that, like, not all puppers, but a lot of puppers like having friends. If Chips and I ever get a puppers, not like we're thinking about it in April or something like that, cough, 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 uh, maybe the puppers would need to have a sibling come with them too. Cough, cough, cough. We'll have to see. Hmm. There's someone at the door. Uh, let's open the door. Just hi. Oh, hi. Hello. It's nice to finally meet you. I'm your neighbor, Luis. Uh, hi, Luis. Nice to meet you. I thought I should come over and let you know about the neighborhood dog. Uh, the entire neighborhood. How does that work? He's a cute little beagle who wanders the streets. A few of us co-own him, I guess. We all do our part to look after him. Wow. I was wondering if he was a stray who needed a home. Oh, so you've already met. Yeah, Mac was excited to make a new friend. That's great. We all love him, though he's a little shy and doesn't stay in one place for long. I'm sure he'll visit more often, and maybe your little dog can make friends with him. I love the idea of sharing a dog. What's his name? I call him Bagel, but I'm not sure what other co others call him. Bagel the Beagle! That's really cute. Well, then, that was all. I'd better go before it gets dark. Have a great night. Thanks. See you later. Okay, now that's fun, except for the fact that, like, you can't really let a dog wander around for a lot of reasons, but especially what if he gets hit by a car? Oh, or like this, in bad weather. A storm rolled in. The howling and pounding is a little unnerving. Claps of thunder and lightning are booming in the distance. Uh-oh. Oh, and Mac is howling and whining. It's okay, buddy. I guess that would be really concerning if you're blind. Mac is shivering with fright. I'm here, Mac. I'm here. You grab some snacks and a blanket, then snuggle in with Mac. You snuggle closer as the thunder cracks. Mac's body quivers against your chest. Oh, stroke Mac's fluffy little head. Oh, the poor boy. Mac continues whining as the storm rages. I know, buddy. I'm worried about Bagel, too. Like, actually, I would be. I was literally just saying how you shouldn't just let him wander around. You continue comforting each other through the night and slowly drift to sleep. 
What a cute story. Normally, like, app games don't bother with such a good story. Knock, knock. Uh-oh. Did something happen to Bagel the Beagle? You are abruptly awoken by a knocking at the door. What? It's this guy. No, wait, I don't know this guy. Hi there, I'm Noah. I work with a dog rescue. Is this the dog sanctuary? Uh, good morning. Yes, this is a dog sanctuary. I probably have dog toys in my hair and like my hair is all ruffled up one side, but I can be professional. We found the neighborhood dog stuck in the sewer drain last night. Have you taken him in? Oh, Bagel! No, but my sanctuary is here for any dog who needs a home. See? This is why he shouldn't be wandering on his own. Oh yeah? He seemed pretty shaken up. I think it would be really good for him to have a more permanent home. Like, absolutely! Who's gonna give him his flea and tick treatments to make sure that he's not going to get all those illnesses? Make sure he's not, like, harassing local wildlife? Make sure that he doesn't get in fights with, like, other dogs or any stray feral cats that are wandering around? Come on, Bagel! Come on in, boy! I'm really happy there's now a dog sanctuary here. I originally asked my brother to look after him since he lives on the street, too. But he's a little afraid of dogs. Ah! No wonder you looked familiar! I'm sure he'll come around one day. They are the best companions. Anyway, the little fella is waiting in my car. Let me grab him for you now. Uh, woo, thank you! You know what? Dog rescues, animal rescues in general, having worked, like, with many of them in the past, it just happens fast. <laughs> you, you just accept that it goes quick. Okay, he's all ready for you. Thanks so much for bringing him here. Is he okay? He was definitely looking a little waterlogged from last night. We cleaned him up as best we could. I think what he needs now is some good old TLC. Uh, you can count on me! Fantastic! I'll leave him in your capable hands. Yay! I'll be in the neighborhood, by the way. If you ever need a hand, just give me a call. Thanks, Noah! Alright! Yay, guys! We're gonna be able to take good care of him! Oh! Bagel! Come on out, boy! Wow, this is a really complicated little storyline. Like, being able to befriend Mac really unlocked a lot. <gasps> Bagel! Look at his little eyeballs! <laughs> Bagel, you sweet boy! Here, let me whip up some fresh treats. I, I, always, I gotta always be bacon. There we go. To bring home the bacon, I suppose. Oh, 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 and we got a little bit messy going on over here. And Mr. Mac needs his pets. Oh, and he wants his toys. Mac, you have a friend now. Here you go. Okay, actually, well, somebody wanted me to give you uh, other toys. But we'll just have to go for that for now. <gasps> Mac is in. Oh, look at this, you guys. Mac's actually just chilling over here, right in his little seat. Oh, that's so cute. All right, that's adorable. I'm glad to see that he's doing well. Uh, we've got some leaves to clean up, which is going to make people happy. Is that a weed? All right, we've got weeds to pull up. Wait, where's Bagel? Bagel! Oh, Bagel! <gasps> Bagel! Bagel is here. He will be officially initiated into the sanctuary. Hey, buddy. New dog blog post. We've got to let everybody know about Bagel. Welcome home, little guy. You try to lead Bagel further inside, but he appears reluctant. Um, let's lower our voice, because he's super shy. Speaking more softly, you do your best to make Bagel feel safe. It's okay, this is your home now. You soften your tone and Bagel shrinks to the ground, watching from the corner of his eyes. Alright, let's offer him a snack. You offer Bagel a small snack. He gives you a suspicious look. Uh, let's reassure him with our voice? Bagel sniffs the treat. It's alright, Bagel. I promise it's safe to eat. Bagel still looks wary, but after a few seconds, he digs in. Oh, we're gonna go ahead and give him space. No pats just yet. He needs to adjust after all. You happily watch Bagel enjoy his snack. Bagel seems a little more at ease now. He curls up and goes to sleep. <laughs> oh, sweet dreams, Bagel. Okay, that was adorable. He's just like, time to flop. All right, that was really cute. And our sanctuary is looking even better too. Yay! Welcome home, Bagel! Look at the little Bagel the Beagle with his little Bagel vest! Oh, and he has a giant Bagel bed! Oh no, I'm gonna need to be very careful about those. Um, but let's go ahead and see what's going on. It's great to see that you've doubled the size of your dog sanctuary already. Having more dogs mean you will need more resources and more donations. A way to do this is by hosting dog streams. What? Putting a dog... During a dog stream, people watching will request that you feed, play, and pet with the dogs. In exchange, they will send you donations. Dog streams are also a great way to interact with your dogs. What? This is cool! 
First, you need to choose a type of treat and toy to use during the dog stream. Okay, well, I have these treats. I've been baking a lot of them. Both followers and dogs have different things that they like. Just something to keep in mind, uh, in mind what items you choose to bring in. Okay, and we're gonna bring in the balls. Nice, are you ready? Just tap the start stream button and I'll explain how this works. Jeez, okay, this is just like actual streaming where you just have to like dive in. Don't think too hard about it. <sighs> okay, don't panic. Your current sanctuary level gives you a stream gives your stream a boost. You will increase your sanctuary level each time you receive loyalty from a dog. Oh, our puppers! They really love us. Okay. All right, I sent you some easy requests now. You'll figure out what to do. Okay, so give pats to puppy. All right. Oh, oh, I see. And then you give him treat, and then you give him toy, and then you give him more pats. Then you give him treat. Uh, let's see. And then you give, okay, give, oh, I see. And now we're starting to get specific. Ah, oh, fantastic. Look how happy the boys are, too. And when there's more than one viewer, you may get several requests at one time. If you complete multiple requests at the same time, you'll get more points. Wow. Okay, so now give treat. Whoa, okay, that spooked me. You're doing awesome. I will send you some more requests now, and you can complete them till time runs out. Oh, geez. Okay, so we're timed. Uh, so, uh, all right, we want to give a treat to the to this guy, and we want to give a treat to this guy. Okay, and this is just kind of like pay attention to the different dogs, but you have to wait until it's like do a treat. Oh, it's what a fun way to do like a combo! I got it. Nice. And then it's just like pet a dog, and then you can actually let it stack for a second, I think, because that will let you go ahead and like get multiple events going down. Oh, and the stream's complete! Sweet! Okay! Wow! Holy cow! Alright, so now I think we got, like, level 2 unlocked. You did great! Each time you level up, you will unlock new valuable things for your sanctuary. So we now have coin cap increase, uh, new items available at the market! <gasps> new item rewards available, and new recipe available to buy in the kitchen! What the heck? That was a lot of stuff, and that was actually a lot of fun to do. <laughs> Wow! Oh my goodness, and look at how messy our puppies are! I have just been constantly having to like run around cleaning up after them. Oh, and somebody needs his pets! And he also needs a toy, so we'll give him a toy. And he's hungry. There we go. We want all of the puppers to feel loved. There, there. And we want all the puppers to feel like they've got enough attention. Boom! Wow, okay you guys. That was a lot! That was a lot! And now all oh, the puppies are digging up holes in the yard too, and that's giving me like materials to work with. Whoa, okay, this is this is so much more than I thought it would be. I'm actually really impressed and amused. Uh this has been quite exciting. Uh but alright guys, I'm gonna go ahead and take a break here because that was a lot of stuff and we've been going on for a little while. But we're doing really great, and I think we're gonna be able to continue taking good care of this dog sanctuary. Huzzah! This is really fun! But alright, if you guys could could, do please leave a like for Bagel and for our good friend Mac. And if you would like to join us on this and literally thousands more adventures, do please consider subscribing. But most importantly, stay curious, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye bye.